Okay, hello guys, assalamualaikum with again with Ombop. This time I have the uh, Red 10 code name is Selene, and it's using the Rice Droid custom ROM on Android 12L or 12.1. Okay, so in this video, I will show you how to make super partition as read and write because uh, you know in the Dynamic partition, you cannot do it on the default setting. So, in this video, I will cover how to do it by using a flexible zip file on custom recovery. Okay, first thing I want to do is let's reboot to the custom recovery. Okay. Spawn support the menu directly to reboot it into the recovery. So select restart and recovery. <coughs> and before this file has tested on the real BC 11, 12, and 15, the Mediatek version. And we will try it on the Red 10. First thing I want to show you that we cannot do write and read spawn. Okay, I'll show you. Spawn system. And it goes to the advanced file manager and let's find some file. Framework. Let's rename the surface jar. Okay. Rename as PAK backup. Fail. It's right here. It said MV or move file fail process ended with error one. Okay. So I'm going to flash the file. So the file goes to the install. Find where you have the file put it in here and the name is system re underscore one point three two flexible okay and just for information <clears throat> if you have a uh, small internal storage like the real me c11 you need to format the data because the process takes some space about 50 gigabyte so you have to format it but this one, the internal storage of this phone is 128 gigabytes, so we have no problem with that. So let's select the file and swipe it. Okay, it will process all the thing. And <clears throat> uh, the process will take a promise, like about 15 minutes. Okay. Because basically it will copy all the file and replace it. Okay. So I will skip this one. And we'll continue after it's finished. And then now for it finished, you can see the process right here. You can ignore the sparse file format. And in here it's create bad super image. Okay. It put the Super image in the data data local temporary folder, and then flash the modify super image. Okay, then after it finish, it deleting the temporary file in the data local temporary. So let's try to five. It's to the surface jar, this is just an example, and rename it. Uh -huh. Okay, it can see right here updating partition detail. You can see now we can rename the file in the system framework or the system vendor. Okay, so 
basically can modify from the therapy and also using the apps from the Android like the root spoiler and other stuff watch poke around change well system okay so guys this is a tutorial on how to modify your dynamic partition using a flexible zip file thank you i hope it helps you see you on the next video and i hope you like my video if you find it very useful please give it a thumb and i also have lots video about routing custom rom and lots of fun okay especially xiaomi samsung realme asus and other stuff okay uh you can find in my video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay guys if you subscribe it will make me excited to make a new video and that's all stay self stay safe stay health and wassalamualaikum